Hey everybody, Rick Nina from beautiful Gulfstream Park, Hallandale, Florida. It's Saturday afternoon, January the 19th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle YouTube race of the day. I'm going to focus on race three this afternoon, folks. It goes to the post at 1.57 p.m. Eastern. It's a six furlong sprint on the dirt track. Phillies and mares four years old and up, racing for an optional claiming purse of $50,500. Contenders number three, Featherbed. Number five, Cash is Girl. Number one, Girls, Pearls. And number four, True and True. Number three, Featherbed is nice early speed for this sprint. Is the pace profile leader in this field. Racing at today's distance of six furlongs on the dirt. Has produced a quartet of power runs in her last five starts, winning twice in this recent streak of racing consistency. The jockey trainer tandem of Johnny Velasquez and Todd Pletcher center to the post today. They've hit the board with 56% of nearly 300 entries saddled as a team to date. Number five, Cash's Girl takes a class drop of 10 units this afternoon. Has turned in power run performances in each of her last five starts, including a pair of power run wins found both in her third and fifth races back. Race three summary, number three, Featherbed tops the contenders list, which also includes number five, Cash's Girl, number one, Girl's Pearls, and number four, True and True. That's 3514 in the third from Gulfstream. I have a couple of bonus long shots for you as usual, folks, both from the state of West Virginia. Let's go to Charlestown first. Uh, race number five, the nine to two shot, number five, 747, takes an 11 unit computerized class drop. It's nice speed for this four and a half for a long sprint. They race at Mountaineer Park in Chester, West Virginia tonight as well. Race number four, ten, uh, entry number 10, header for home, eight to one on the morning line, is the speed leader in this claiming field, racing at tonight's distance of five furlongs on the dirt. So from a Gulfstream Park on a Saturday afternoon, Rick Needham for the Equibase Winter Circle YouTube and our buddies at dayatthetrack.com where, yes, I do indeed watch and wager on the Internet, thoroughbred and harness racing. Rick Needham reminding you, as always, to please bet with your head, not over it.